Traces draws its ideas from Timothy Ingold's writings on lines, threads and traces. In this piece for Ruth, I set out to clearly mark silence and space as the landscape on which Ruth was tracing. Timothy Ingold states that most traces are of one or other of two kinds, additive or reductive. In this case, they are behaving additively to the silent landscape. But my process was very much one of reducing and reducing the amount of musical material used. I wanted to create a space with room to breathe, something that is not so common in most of my work. Thank you so much to Ruth for asking me to write and to the funding bodies who enabled this. I hope you find some space in the piece. <laughs>